Hey there, this is Lana, the Comedian Medium. I'm bringing you your... Ooh, I'm dumping stuff over. Uh, bringing you your love and relationship for Leo for August 2020. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading or hypnosis. Please visit EnchantedSky.com. You can book a reading. You can look at all my Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Uh, my my blog page is TheWiseWomanSage.com. <laughs> You can find all kinds of stuff about me on there, too. <laughs> um, in the process of going, of having a social media manager at this point, I'm that busy. I've been all over the, getting calls from all over the world, which is no problem because everything converts. And I'm using a couple of apps that work really good. I just talked to somebody from Greece a couple of days ago. So uh, with that said, I'm going to get on with this. Um Got a, got a joke for you. So what do you do when you see a space, man? You park in it, man. <laughs> I know it's corny. People are starting to give me jokes too. So just kind of telling some stale ones. It's okay. So let's get on with this. Let's see what we get. I got my, I got some Leos in my life. My son-in-law, a really good friend of mine is a Leo. My mother-in-law is a Leo. There's lots of Leos. Let's see what we get. Okay. So, okay, here we go. Um, you had made a choice. And you had gotten the woman of your dreams. And you had made your choices. Um, maybe that one choice wasn't what it should have been, but you made your choice and you're going forward with it, forward with it. Now you're taking the bull by the horns about something. And I want to say that there's something with the relationship you're wanting. I want to say that possibly somebody in your relationship is maybe going through something that maybe they it, it maybe have they maybe have a monkey on their back. I don't think it's you per se. I think it's somebody else, but it might be yourself. But you're trying to heal and you're asking for help from somebody. Okay, so you've got your part. You're trying to be. You're trying to learn temperance now. Anybody that knows about the temperance uh, movement of the early. 19, uh, 1900s, temperance means not drinking too much, you know, and usually, but it's, it's temperance also means not everything in moderation. So it appears to me that somebody's trying to learn how to back it off and they may be getting help or they might be helping somebody, um, through it because they're, they're struggling right now. Okay. It may be, it's you, Maybe it's somebody else, but you're struggling, okay, with something, some type of addiction, some type of monkey on your back, okay? You know, you see, you got into this relationship and you made your choice and, uh, you know, and you know that it's, there's been hard work, but you're seeing it for what it really is because, you know, the, 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 the rose-colored glasses are off, okay? And right now, this is as low as it's going to get because you're going to get some kudos you're going to get some help you're going to get some um accolades something something's going to come through to help get you in your 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 position that you're wanting now I'll be honest with you somebody's lying to you so there this could be you this could be them but somebody's not being honest all right now there's a message coming. Now, these are my overall cards, which means the overall theme. Something's coming, Page of Swords. Okay, so this feels like it's written. So it's either written as a text or written as a piece of paper. Somebody, something's coming for you. Um, and I want to say there's there's authority involved. Maybe you need to see a doctor or a therapist or, you know, you need some help that you can't do this by yourself. Because I feel like you're going, there's something where you're going to try to help yourself. I mean, this could even be money matters. This is this is a loved one. This is somebody you're in a relationship with. So it's either you're in a relationship with them or they're in a relationship with you, okay? And 
there's lies being told, but but I also know one thing that it's as bad as it's going to get. It's going to in a minute of August. It's going to get better. Now, I always say that this is the card of crying over spilt milk. Now, if you look at the, he's crying over the three cups gone. But if you notice, there's two cups up, and then the cow is off the card. So that's kind of what I say about the whole thing. But they're trying to urge you through this whole thing to try to achieve temperance, to not go overboard, to try to control what is going on. Are you spending too much? Are you gambling? Are you shopping too much online? What are What's going on? Or are they? All I know is it looks to me like some help is coming for and some, somebody that has an addiction. Okay? And I want to say it's a person that you thought was just the ideal mate. And this also could be a fire card. Now, fire signs, that is their card, is temperance. Because we have a tendency, us, us fire cards, our fire signs, to go a little overboard. <laughs> okay? We're a fire sign. We're like a, you know, I always say it and they, people laugh at me. It's a bull in a china shop. Somebody said I said a bullet in a china shop. I, I Bull in a china shop. All right? It's an expression. All right? So, um, you know, this could be a, a Le this could be you also, because remember, if this is Leo, it's a Leo reading. So, and Leo is a fire sign. So Leo, Sagittarius or Aries. Okay. So it may be telling you, maybe you need some help. You know? Yeah. You yeah, throw, ooh, harmony, positive, move forward, balance here. Here you go again. Now, these cards are just an extension. They're, they're my um, psychic tarot. Now, your base chakra is staying grounded. Staying grounded is usually in your head. You know, don't go overboard. Oh, you know, I can't go out and spend that on that. I really want that, but I can't do it. I have bills to pay, and it's coming due in six weeks. It's my insurance, and I have to make sure I have insurance on my car. That's a base chakra decision, okay? Your throat chakra, something needs to be said to somebody. Maybe maybe it's your, sp your spouse or your significant other that's doing something that's really, really tearing things apart, okay? Either way, it's like I said, it's a temperance thing. You're seeking harmony, though. You're seeking a balance and a harmony. And like I said, I feel like for some of you guys, you may have had the person of your dreams and your, the, the blinders are off. And there's much more serious stuff going on, Okay. But there is a positive move forward. There's positive and there's a triumph. So you're going to achieve this balance. See, look at there's a balance here. You're going to achieve it and you're going to be okay. All right. It's what you're going through now in the month of August. Month this this August, we're getting a lot of um not just love and relationship, but in general, it seems like it's a very significant, almost even very emotional month as we're coming out with shots for COVID. And I had predicted it way back in maybe April that there would be something coming out August. And yes, there is something in India, uh, August 15th. They're coming out with the, the first sets. And I still predict here in the United States sometime in right after, not far from that, I'm saying about October. Okay, um, and we will be back to fairly normal by this, by January. And that is a repeat from what I was told. That is not me talking. I got that as I channel. So just thought I would mention. It will never be quite the same, though. There will be a lot. I feel like we're going to be worse uh, for wear. It means we'll be better off than we were when we started. So now, with that said... They want you, this is a time for growth. When everybody right now is having vivid dreams, everybody is, everybody, we're consciously evolving as a species. And if you're looking, you need to get rid of the negative habits. So if, if it's not you and it's your significant other, you need to be there to support them. And they need to be there to support you in case it's, but it's one or other, it's one of you. It's one or the other of you, all right? Um, like I said, there could be a police involved. There could be a counselor involved. There could be the uh, a judge involved. There's somebody of power 
involved in all of this. You may have to go to the court. Maybe you maybe you have to go to get dried out. Seriously. Okay? Maybe you have a drug addiction and you need to go to rehab. There's something or maybe your spouse does. But that's what I see in this. That this is what you're going to be working on in the month of August. Whatever that's not bad, that good for you is going to be addressed. Okay? Blessings to all you. I'll be coming out with your um, cusp readings and then your rest of your readings uh, within the next couple days. Blessings.